Hey everyone, it's Dylan and Charlie from the Black Forest Wood Company. This week we're going to be showing you our first ever resin cast Lazy Susan dining table. So this piece is created from Buckeye Burl and we've got an orange resin in the table with a bit of a pinkish hue. And then in the Lazy Susan we've got a purple resin with a bit of a bluish hue. And we do actually have hardware in here that lets this whole thing spin. But you guys are going to have to watch the whole video if you want to see that. And as always, let us know what you think about these pieces in the comments.
so Curtis has done uh, his finishing coats on here. Uh, it's cured up. Everything looks absolutely beautiful on this table. And we've actually got the Lazy Susan set on there right now. We don't actually have it in the recesses that we've put in the table because we don't want to risk scratching the finish. So there is a piece of foam under. Um, so what will change is this gap that you see underneath, it's only going to be one millimeter when everything's all put together. It still spins right now, but when the foam's not underneath there, it actually spins for a lot longer. Like if I was to do this, it, it would continue to spin after I let go. Um, but all in all, again, turned out really, really good. So we'll, we'll actually lift this Lazy Susan off right now and show you the hardware that we've got underneath there. Okay, so here's our hardware that we've got. Um, it's just, it's essentially just like a big bearing. And this inside piece here, this is what we screw through and actually fasten to the, the Lazy Susan. And we've got the little recesses or little dimples here that go into a recess in, in the Lazy Susan. And then on the other side, there's some more recesses that you guys see right here. And those, those get placed in the recesses you see on the table. So everything kind of lines up and fits perfectly. And then if we go over to the Lazy Susan, I'll show you guys how it fits in there. Here's the Lazy Susan itself. Um, and as you guys can see, there's all those little recesses in there. And essentially then all we do is drop this in, the Lazy Susan falls into place. See if I can get it to go here, just like that. And then the bearing can spin. This just sits in those recesses. Um, and there's, if you guys want to buy this for yourself, vxb.com does come from China, um, but they work good. And then beside the Lazy Susan, this is the base that we're going to be doing on that table. So this is made out of solid ash and we've just done our standard black and finish. So to achieve this, we wire brush the wood and then we stain it black and then put our black forest furniture oil over top. And this is actually what's going to sit underneath that whole table when it's all done. And look at Charlie being such a good boy just waiting, sitting, doing his job. Good boy, Charlie. So thank you guys for watching this week's video. Uh, this table turned out absolutely phenomenally. Uh, I have to give a huge shout out to the team, uh, especially I want to give a shout out to Curtis. Uh, he's been doing a lot of our finishing recently and I think this is like the first big round table that he's actually done and the finish that he did on here with our Black Forest furniture oil and our ceramic looks absolutely gorgeous. So. Big shout out to Curtis and let us know what you guys think of this table. Honestly, at first we were, we were a little hesitant because we didn't know about this color combination and how it was all going to look with the Buckeye. But after seeing it all together, uh, I think it all complements each other quite nicely. Uh, but that's just my opinion. So let us know what you guys think and we'll see you next week.